My name is Natalie Sue Severchek, and I'm pleased to introduce our paper, Preparing Teachers with Sociocultural Knowledge and Literacy, a Literature Review. My co-authors from the University of Texas at Austin include Dr. Melissa Mosley-Wetzel, Sabakan Vlock, Erica Steinitz, Lakia Omegon, Corey Samaran, Natalie Batista Morales, Doris Villarreal, and from Rhodes College, Dr. Laura A. Taylor. We are a linguistically, racially, and religiously diverse group of scholars who have committed to connecting sociocultural knowledge and literacy throughout our work in teacher education and scholarship. In 2000, Zhu posed, little attention has been paid to an integration of diversity into literacy methods courses. 16 years later, the Literacy Research Association called for engagement with issues of race and racism in literacy. Drawing on Zhu's urging and this recent call, we ask, what have we done to not remain peripheral to issues of racism as a field of literacy teacher education? In this literature review, we synthesize the findings of 109 research studies that address the preparation of teachers in the area of sociocultural knowledge identified in the site I tell database, a joint project of LRA and UT Austin. Primarily drawing on humanizing critical sociocultural knowledge of teachers, we asked, what do we know about how to prepare teachers to teach literacy in ways that disrupt inequalities and lead to more just and equitable educational practices? Five categories comprehensively represented what pre-service teachers learned as a result of courses and practical experiences. Examining one's self and experiences, recognizing students' lives and resources in literacy teaching, considering race, racism, and students' racial identity, understanding multilingualism as a strength for literacy, and engaging actively and inquiring into literacy. We also analyzed the barriers teacher educators identified across studies we reviewed, considering variation between the experiences of white and pre-service teachers of color. The practices that were most promising led to pre-service teachers questioning and disruption of deficit discourses of students and the social practices that hold inequalities in place. Implications for this work for teacher preparation programs might include considerations for a sequence of experiences guided by these five categories. Teacher educators might consider the barriers these researchers found to anticipate and provide tools for pre-service teachers to engage in these tensions. We are hopeful about what we know about how to prepare pre-service teachers to disrupt hegemony through literacy education and yearn for studies that center literacy as a tool for critical analysis and transformation. 